is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. Today we have another debut for a different finest 99 card. Now, last debut we had 99 Cody Bellinger. This time around, we have Alex Breckman 99's finest from 2019. Now, we definitely got lucky that we didn't have to buy this card because he's still going for about uh, 150,000 stubs. So I'm definitely glad we didn't have to buy him. We pulled him out of a finest elite pack. So, um, yeah, we didn't have to spend the stubs. Now, let's check out his stats before we start anything. Let's check out his stats. All right, so here we go. He has 98 contact versus righties, 125 contact versus lefties, 108 power versus righties, and 125 power versus lefties. That is freaking insane. This might be the best hitting third baseman in the game right now. He also has 124 vision, which is going to be ideal especially if you're playing in like hall of fame or legend in ranked seasons that is going to be key to that pci play uh pci size now his fielding is where he is not quite at nolan or uh status i want to say like i want to compare this card with nolan let me let me let, let's compare him side by side so when it comes to the hitting he pretty much beats him in absolutely everything except contact versus righties and it's only an eight freaking point difference that's not even that big of a deal so as far as hitting he's a lot better because he beats him by a lot too it's not just like a couple points when it comes to the fielding however it's not even that bad it's not that bad nolan hasn't beaten everything as you can expect nolan is possibly the best third baseman in the game right now as far as fielding but he still has 83 fielding versus nolan's 90 87 reaction versus nolan's 88 87 arm strength versus uh nolan arenado's 97th so he's still gonna get the throw across just in time and he has 74 arm accuracy versus nolan's 84. if you ask me he's going to do just fine at third base i'm pretty sure you can also play him at shortstop uh i believe his secondaries are let me see first base shortstop and left field honestly i think you can play this card anywhere you want and he's still going to be solid as far as fielding goes now as far as freaking hitting we got to test this card out we have to test this card out now normally i would want to test this card in ranked seasons but since they do have the new world series event and it is in hall of fame difficulty i think i'm just gonna try him there since i do need about i want to say an, uh, another 14 wins in order to get to those 20 wins and get all four vouchers so we're gonna try him out in events and I think we're still going to be able to get a pretty good uh, a pretty good feedback on how this card performs since it is going to be in Hall of Fame. So with that being said, let's get to it. I just want to find a game. And here we go. We're playing Los Angeles Dodgers Joey AK7. And we got Gary Cole on the mound. Actually, that's I don't think we've done a debut for him on the channel. So this is actually this actually works out for us. All right, one and two count. I don't need to throw a strike, so I'm gonna try to get him to chase here. Come on, buddy. Okay, easy out. I will take it. Thank you. We got one. All right, so we have Carlos Correa here. Oh boy. Ooh. That could have been bad. That's two. He's gonna have two outs right here. Comes here comes the run somehow, some way. That was easy. Okay, here we go. Hopefully, we do get to fourth, to our fourth batter, though. All right, Soto. This is not about you. This is not about you. Is that going to drop? I think it is, bro. This one Zoto card has been... Oh, God, no. I'm host. Now, I'm going to be host at first base. Oh, God. You with me. I don't know why I did that. Here we have it. Alex Bregman. What is he going to do? Oh, we're going to find out. All right, I feel like I was all over that, but so for some reason we missed it. It's all good though. He was very late, but that looked like okay. Let me see. Come on, let's go, baby. Let's go. All right, first game. We only had one at bat with Bregman, but it's all good. We'll keep we'll keep playing and we'll keep adding more freaking at bats. I mean, oh my God, this guy's team sucks. Let me see his record. 35 and 39. 
These are the type of players I lose to. Come on, baby! See you later! Let's freaking go! Let's go, baby! Strike up. Coming for you guys. Enjoy this. Here we go. Get it. Ha! <laughs> Got it! Get out of here! Just for you guys. Enjoy. Ha! Got it! Ha! It is! To close out the game. All right, whatever. He, he pretty much gave us that one, but hey, I will take it. Okay, on to the next game. Hopefully, we can get at least two at bats with Alex Bregman. All right, guys, game number three. I put Bregman to hit second this time. I put him to hit second so that we get as many at bats as possible. Now, we're facing Garrett Cole. We shall see how this is going to go for us because this is actually probably the best pitcher we've faced uh, with Bregman so far. So, here comes Bregman. Come on, buddy. His PCI definitely looks smaller, though. Here. Shame on me. Strike up. Come on, buddy. Oh, boy. Ooh! Ah! Got him! Got him! Ah! What? Okay. I don't even know what to tell you guys. I don't know if he actually lost connection or if he quit. I'll take it. Okay, here we go. Game number four. This afternoon, two and oh now. There's guys this afternoon, 84 And we're gonna lead off with a double with my boy. The one and only. The 21 year old. It almost feels like this should be his debut and not Alex Bregman's. Come on. Alright, Bregman is facing a lefty, ladies and gentlemen. Can we go? Oh, he, we're playing it. We're playing at Minute Maid Park. Oh man, come on, Bregman. You gotta go yard here, bro. I have to. I have to hit a dinger here. Just when I thought we were going to face a lefty. And we're going to get a nice little double over the first basement with Alex Bregman. I'll take that. I'll take that. You know what? I will take that. That wasn't terrible. We drove it the opposite way. That was a good at bat. That was a good at bat. I don't know what to tell you. That was down the middle. That was a um, a splitter down the middle, man. I don't know how this guy missed it. But he's not gonna quit. I like that. All right. Ah! Got him! Ah! All right, here we go. Game number five. Hopefully, man. Hopefully, we get at least more than one at bat this one game. Oh, we're facing a really good team. This guy actually has a really nice lineup, and it's gonna be Garrett Cole versus Garrett Cole again. Last time that my Bregman faced Garrett Cole, we popped up, so hopefully we can redeem ourselves here. All right, Soto. Oh my God! Look at the look at this backdrop. Honestly, I cannot see anything, man. This. Why would you choose this time of the day? Why? Alex Bragman redeeming himself against Garrett Cole. Did we get him again? It is out of here. Okay, okay. Better get that Garrett Cole out of here. been too good to be true all right it's all good i get it i get it i don't get it the time hasn't changed since this game started it's the same it's the same but it doesn't matter let's go baby all right alex come on buddy and that baby is later let's go baby that's two that's two in this game. And we're going to get him to strike out. That is going to be the game. Let's go, man. 5-0 this run. 
Bengals. Let's check Bre Bregman's stats. All right, so we're hitting 571 in only seven at bats, though. He did get, he got four hits, one double, four RBIs. How many home runs did he hit? And he had three home runs. So in seven at bats, Bregman had three home runs, four RBIs, four runs, and four hits, one double. Hitting 571. Guys, I got to say, I'm loving this card. I'm loving this card. Unfortunately, we didn't hit as many times as I would have liked, but we still got seven at bats. In a regular ranked season game, we probably would have gotten only, I want to say, four, maybe five if we got lucky. But um, I feel like we, we, we managed to get a really good feel for this card. I'm definitely going to keep using him. I'm definitely going to use him for ranked seasons. Um, I want to weigh him out with Nolan Arenado and see who I like best. I love Nolan, honestly. So it's going to be hard for me to take off, uh, take out Nolan and leave Bregman. But I got to try him a little bit more. We'll see, though. Let me know if you guys like this video, guys. Um, it's something. It, it was a little different. Usually, I just do debuts in ranked seasons. I decided to do this because I didn't need the extra wins for the event. I feel like we still managed to get a pretty good gameplay out of Bregman. So um, let me know if you guys liked it. If you did, hit that thumbs up button. If you're not already subbed, hit that sub button. Again, guys, let me know if, what you guys want to see next. With that being said, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.